Hey everybody, what's going on? Your host AMF1534 here. Welcome back to Let's Play Some More Among the Sleep. And uh, it got interesting last time on the way to pick up our third memory, which was our book. And uh, while we were looking for that thing, we uh, had a nice little encounter with the thing that's been stalking us this whole time. We got captured by it a number of different occasions. And let's just say it was effing creepy to the max. So now we're going to go place our third I've memory in the thingamajig like here it. and move on. Yeah, a I haven't seen anything like it either. Have to go through this. No, but this is a very unique case where the child is definitely going to go through this. Hey, it's going to be so nice when we're through with all this and we can play together all the time. Why do I have this weird underlying feeling that Teddy is going to totally end up being a bastard at the end of this? <laughs> I just have that feeling. What the hell? Oh, there it is. I was wondering why that wasn't showing up. I kept hitting the inventory button and it wasn't coming in. Alright, so... We got we went through a lot to get that book. I mean, countless amounts of getting our asses picked up and... I don't know. I don't really know if we got killed by that thing or not. I mean, it would just... Good. I'm sure she is. Okay. I'm here. Like, do you see what I mean? Like, there's something about him that's really starting I to make me feel uncomfortable. No other choice. I Should just see where it takes us next. Yeah, I'm yeah, I'm, I'm down for are. that. Like, are you guys getting that vibe at all, or is it just me? Because I, I have this weird feeling that at the end of this, he's totally gonna turn on us, and he's gonna be the guy that we have to take down. I don't know why I'm thinking that, but I just. I'm looking at, maybe I'm just overanalyzing it a little bit, but I'm look, every time I hear him talking to us, it sounds more like a, you know, when this is all over, like, foreshadowing to the extreme, when this is all over, you and I can play together all the time, just you and I, because everybody will be out of the fucking way. But he's trying to make it sound like he's, you know, on my side. Which, so far, he is. But we don't really know, necessarily, what, uh, what that little concoction of doors even does. So I guess we're just gonna have to uh, find out. This doesn't look like a very friendly home. Looks like it's been more or less ravaged by things. I don't like all the creaking that's going on either. What the hell's in there? You seeing that? What the hell's doing that? don't know I don't know how I feel about that I don't feel like we should be hanging out down here for much longer cuz that thing's gonna break open why is the oh that's just the hinge I was like why is the handle so low on that oh boy what have we got here Whoever it is, either they're just moving in or they're getting ready to move out. I don't know which one it is. <laughs> if it were me, I wouldn't be moving into a place that looked like this. This place is fucking scary. Okay, now we're now we're even here. Which I'm guessing we're supposed to open this thing up. Shkublin! Whoa! Jeez! That was a long little bridge. Alright, we need to get up on this thing now before it goes away. Come on. Use your crawling skills there, pal. Okay. Not as long as I thought it was going to be. Wow. The echo on... Whoa! The echo on that bottle breaking was actually kind of cool sounding. Alright. Now what have you? Ball anyone? Not bad. Not a bad toss. Sign him up to, you, to be a pitcher someday. Maybe he'll get drafted by the Padres like Johnny Manziel, who hasn't played high uh, hasn't played baseball since high school. Just fucking stupid, by the way. Okay. Uh oh. All right. 
I don't need any part of that. Unfortunately, we're gonna have to deal with that at some point. Okay, let's move. I didn't really catch a glimpse of it. Was that the same thing? I mean, I didn't even see a body. Or anything, for that matter. Okay, sir. Oh! The hell? I saw a pair of eyes coming through the wall. That was not cool. I heard growling. I don't know if I like all these no- Dude, my skin's tingling right now. Like, I don't like all these noises. In case you're wondering what the ominous whirr noise was, because I think you'll probably be able to hear it. That was just my garage door. Curse my room having to be directly above the garage. It's definitely been quite the influence on some of my jump scares in previous Let's Plays like this. Okay, I don't know if I'm going to go there yet. But I will go... Huh. At least that photo wasn't disappearing like the other ones. Okay, well there's nothing in there either. So I guess we're gonna do it. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Whoa! Oh, that thing just fell over. <laughs> oh, boy. Do I want to go in there? I can't, well, I can't go in that way, but... Oh, great. If that's indicative that something's on the other side of this, I'm not really... not really excited to go through it. I don't really think I have a lot of a choice, though. What the hell was that? I know that was more than just a breeze. Especially with all that tar-looking stuff on the ground. Huh? What? Fuck is... Dude, what is going on? What is making all that noise? Oh boy. You know, one facet about this game that's oddly similar to the condemned uh, Bloodshot game is all the black tar looking stuff. For those of you that haven't played that game, there you should. What the fuck was that? There's a very strange resemblance here with, with that little mechanic. It's not even really a mechanic, it's just something that's also in that game. That is here too, seemingly. Yeah, whatever was in there, you can go away now. Whew. Okay, here we go. Am I holding an object? To use it to throw it. What am I throwing? Oh. Playing a little mini game here. I don't really know what needs to be going into that slot. kind of weird. I don't really know what I'm supposed to be throwing right now. I mean, they want me to throw something. I just don't know what exactly that is. Maybe I need the baseball. It's the hardest of all these things. Huh. Yeah, I can see that it's locked. I just don't... What am I... Tr am I trying to knock something over, or... I don't really know what I'm supposed to be throwing or where I'm throwing it at. Hmm. Hey! <sighs> Fuck. Well, there goes that. I mean, I still feel like we're supposed to be throwing something at this target, but it's not doing anything. Pick up the damn thing. Let's go. This is kind of bothering me. I just... I don't know what I'm supposed to be throwing at. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is weird. Obviously, it does not go in there. 
obviously doesn't go in there either. Hmm. I am very, very confused. Oh. Got it. Whoa! What in God's name is going on? Okay. Pick the thing up. Come on, run to the door, buddy. Yep. Okay, sorry it took so long to figure that puzzle out, guys. I did not think about looking up there. That was kind of a stupid move on my on my part. But at least we got it. Again, puzzles are much, much harder to figure out when I'm sitting here, like, trying to narrate things for you guys. But, hey, at least we got it done. And now we know how we're supposed to figure these out. I mean, there's obviously the keys being held in something, like over there. Okay, let's, let's go check that out. I don't really know where we're going to be throwing things. Uh-oh. What the hell is that? Do you hear that? What's that sound? That sounds like a piano. Or a very loud thud. Dude, I'm two year old. Oh! <laughs> I mean, if it were me, I don't think I would have been. That would have been a lot more than just a simple cry like that. It would have been more like a. Well, I'm not gonna do it because it would just be fucking really loud, and annoying. But you get you get the gist of what I'm saying. It'd be in two year old terms. Okay, so. We got another problem to deal with here. Is this another one of those scenarios? Cause that one of the last one of those had something for us to climb on. Okay, this isn't good. I gotta figure out how to get to the star. Unfortunately, I can't really see very much. Here we go. This looks like it might be the answer to our problems. If I can open the door. There we go. Or I can close it again. <laughs> Whichever one comes first. Come on. Up you go. There we go. Okay. Boy, this is a lot of work. Just to go get that thing. Is it stuck again? Yes, it is. Because this crate's in the way. We need to move it. Oh my god. Need to move it over here. Bingo. That's that shit I'd be talking about right there. Can't really see exactly where we're headed. I'm guessing there's probably a surface we can get down on over here. At least that's what I'm hoping for. Um, you know, I'm not really seeing anything. Besides, besides, uh, uh nope! <laughs> that was a bad choice. Yep, I'm dead. I just killed a two-year-old. I did. I am a murderer. What the hell was that? Okay. That was a lot just now. At least it kind of like saved our progress. However, I don't like... What is going on? What's with the constant whirring and the blurring lines thing here? I'm not talking Robin Thicke right now. Whatever it is, I do not like it. So, is this going to work, possibly? It looks to be. Alright. Well, that's good. <laughs> we had to go through a couple of a couple of strange deaths to get over here, but nonetheless, here we are. Can we take that? No? Maybe it's in here. Please don't let there be something bad in here. I got a weird feeling of that. Thank God this isn't that kind of game where you're going to find, like, a disembodied head just sitting in here. What's in here? 
God, there are a lot of doors in here. It's definitely not going to be going in that one. Oh, is that our kitchen again? Oh, that's where the star thing's at. Well, hold on. I got. I, I need to... The explorer in me quivers at the opportunity to figure out what's in here. Okay, maybe this was the right way to go. Or maybe it wasn't. What in the fuck is up with this house? God. Okay, let's take our chance at the creepy kitchen. We're kind of running low on time here, but... I mean, that seemingly is where the thing is. So we gotta kind of deal with that. Oh boy. Let's go through this. Just because I feel like we're supposed to. What the hell is that? Okay, here we go. This is how we're gonna bring the thing down. Bring it all down! Oh, come on! Perfect. Uh-oh. Oh, oh shit. Pick it up! What are you doing, man? Pick up the thing! Oh, God. Oh, boy. That was... That was a less than comforting experience. It has all the drawers emptied everywhere. God, I hate that every time we go to open one of those cabinets up, then the, uh, the light turns off. Okay, at least we got it. Now I gotta know if there's some sort of faster way to get back. Oh, it's probably in that other door over here. Oh god, that scared the shit out of me. Come on. Is this the right way? Wait a minute. This isn't even the same room, is it? This is not the same room. What the hell? They went and changed everything on us. Oh, no, they didn't. Okay, never mind. It seemed different for some reason. Oh, boy. Okay, we... Wait a minute, how the hell do we get down from here? Oh, boy. Um... How do I get down from here? That's interesting enough in itself. Okay, guys, well, we don't really have the time to try to figure out how to get down from here, so when we come back next time on Let's Play some more Among the Sleep, we gotta take this little star emblem and go put it in the door so we can move on to probably an even more confusing puzzle in itself. But when we come back, that's what we're gonna do. So until then, this is your host, AMF1534, saying thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.